Gladys and welcome to Is That Your Hair? If you're new here, consider tapping that subscribe button and hitting the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. And if you've been rocking with me for a minute, what's up, what's good, and welcome back. All right, y'all, so y'all saw the title. I got some new new, okay? And this is not a sensational or outre unit. This is a unit by The Stylist. Now, from what I understand, this unit is available on both Amazon and Sans Beauty. I think y'all are really gonna rock with this one, so keep on watching. So the name of the unit that we have today is Miss Tasty, okay? She's a 13 by six frontal. One thing that really stood out to me about this unit is the fact that you can actually choose the color of your lace. On a synthetic wig no way I think that's pretty game-changer because I know that's something that people have been asking for and to see it finally come to life on a synthetic sounds like a win already so I chose the brown lace for Miss Tasty now this is what Miss Tasty looks like and she is oh wow she's pretty she's very soft she has a few long layers and she has some bang action going on here at the front so for this unit you'll notice that on the stock card, it shows her with a side part. So I just want to toss this on and see how she is looking straight out the gate. Let's see what we're working with. Oh. Oh. Well, hello. <laughs> okay, Tasty. This is what we're doing. Wow. Oh, I wasn't expecting all of this. Oh, y'all. Okay, let me look. Girl. <laughs> I can already tell that this one is hitting. And it was sitting real comfortable on my head, too. Definitely feeling pretty big head friendly to me. So, yes, y'all, I'm going to bring the music back in style her up and then i'll be back with my thoughts on her and i'm also going to compare it to sensational daisha which is normally at least ten dollars more so keep on watching color whatever it's called we're getting choices now y'all in a synthetic wig for lace that's pretty major to me comment down below if you feel the same like i'm still blown by that and this brown lace is melting in pretty good pardon me if you see a cast because if you do my bad i feel like my eyes be playing tricks on me these days and some lighting there's a cast then i get a new lighting there's no cast i don't know y'all i'm still trying to figure out the best way to get rid of this halo and all types of lighting but i guess it just depends on the lace Either way, I'm not going to stress myself out about it. But yes, love the brown lace. And for this wig, I pretty much wore it glueless in the front area. So here is glueless, right? But on the side, because it was flipping up and I didn't want that to flip up too much on camera, I just used my bedhead spray like I normally do to tack that down. 
and we were pretty much good to go with that. Now, if you like versatility with your wigs, you're gonna love the 13 by six frontal area, which I think is a, a pretty nice space that they give you. They don't skip on the frontal space, that's great. So all across here, you can part your hair and do whatever you need to do. I love the length, it's definitely coming down on me past my boobies, <laughs> so like a good 26 inches or so. The texture feels like kinky straight hair, and I also really like the style. Even though this is also doing like curls in the front, straight in the back type of thing, I like the curls a little bit more on this one compared to Daisha. And of course, another pro is the price. The fact that you can find this for as low as $39 for a 13 by 6 frontal is just it's just beyond me so i'm really happy about that all right y'all so before we go into a nice comparison between miss tasty here and sensational dacia i wanted to just quickly tell y'all about a new way to support my channel okay so i recently signed up for a website called buymeacoffee.com and the premise of this site is to help support and fund your favorite creatives right so i signed up so basically it's a cute platform where you can buy someone a coffee and the coffee might be three dollars five dollars it's just a fun way to show support and show some love sprinkle some joy to your favorite content creators so i will leave my specific link in the description box down below if i have helped you in any type of way through is that your hair feel free to spread some joy maybe buy me a coffee <laughs> It's just another way to let me know that you appreciate what I do here. I'm also thinking about doing some type of like membership on that site where I provide more exclusive content to people who are part of the membership. I was thinking of doing a few set one-on-ones a month where you can consult with me about anything hair, wig related. I have a few ideas in mind. So if you're interested in a membership as well on that platform, let me know in the comments and I'll just set it up, right? Oh my God, what happened to my lighting? Oh. Sorry y'all, the sun moved, the lighting changed, it threw me off. <laughs> okay, we're back. But yes, if you're interested in that type of setup on that platform, let me know. It's basically similar to like Patreon, OnlyFans, and things of that nature. So yeah, just a little something we tried in 2021. Please let me know your thoughts in the comments. All right, here are some differences between Sensational Daisha and Miss Tasty. The most notable difference, without even opening the wig, <laughs> is the price. I've seen Sensational Daisha for as high as $56 in a natural color, whereas Tasty, I've seen her for $39 in a natural color. I also saw her on Amazon for about $48 as well, so that's just good to know. I'll have both links in the description box in case one place sells out, you never know. Also, you know I had to plug in my Amazon affiliate link. So go ahead and shop through there if you want to. <laughs> Oh my god, y'all, if I keep changing colors, bear with me. I'm trying to catch the sun before it goes down. But yes, so the price is a big difference. And I feel like this being $39, because that's how much I paid, oh my god. I, I just can't, like, this is amazing for the price. Absolutely amazing. And even for the $48 on Amazon, if I just wanted to, like, get one wig, I would pay that too, because this is beautiful. As far as cap construction, yes, Daisha and Tasty are both 13 by 6 frontals. However, Sensational Daisha has a total of four combs, two in the front, one in the middle, one in the back, whereas Tasty has two combs in the front and one in the back. Also, I noticed a difference in the cap itself. The cap on Daisha is a mesh cap and you cannot see the tracks straight through, whereas on Tasty, it's a cap where you can clearly see the tracks right through the wigs so i guess that's a good thing if you want a wig cap that is more ventilated but just know that your tracks are also more exposed with tasty as far as the style they both have a similar style right now i am wearing tasty as she came which was with the side part but of course i can part her up however i want through the frontal i actually prefer the style on tasty more than daisha you already know what i said about daisha in the first video that i didn't like that they gave me four curls i just really want these curls all throughout the unit that's really it you see here it's like totally straight just put it throughout the unit <laughs> and with tasty i think they just gave me a little bit more curls to play with so i think it just looks better but overall i would say the style between the two are very similar as far as the texture i noticed a little difference here the texture on both daisha and tasty are definitely kinky straight Tasty, however, is giving me kinky straight with a slight press to the hair, you know what I mean? Because I see a little bit more shine in, in um, Tasty. Y'all see that? But it's a healthy shine. It doesn't look 
fake whatsoever. It's just the luster on Daisha is just a little bit lower. I'll say that. But this looks good. This reminds me of like fresh out the salon. What? Yo, I still can't go with the price of this joint, for real, for real. And also, I notice when I run my fingers through Tasty, it feels, I don't know, it doesn't feel exactly the same as Daisha. It might just be like a minor nuance. I've tried so many textured synthetic wigs on my channel, so I'm starting to pick up on really small things that maybe the average person wouldn't. So I think that might be what it is, but it just feels a little bit, I don't know, I feel like I'm catching snags a little bit more. But you see how that just glided through. <laughs> I'm talking about snags, it's gliding through my hair. Nah, but I feel like I'm catching a little bit more snags when I glide my fingers through my hair tasty versus when I first glided my fingers through Daisha. As far as the hairline, now we know that What Lace is normally known for their very pre-plucked hairline, but I think the hairline on Tasty is definitely comparable to Daisha. I don't see much of a difference, do you? Let me know in the comments down below. I wish I put these on a mannequin head, but I hope y'all get the point seeing it on my hands. And also the length is pretty much the same too. I believe Daisha on Sensational's website said like 26 inches and I'm pretty sure this is the same length here for Tasty. So I hope that comparison was very helpful to you all. If it was helpful, please let me know in the comments. Overall, I think Tasty is absolutely gorgeous. I'm gonna call this a must have wig. Yes, I said it, it's a must have. And I don't say that about a lot of wigs, but she is everything to me right now she's beautiful she's luscious she's the perfect density like she's thick but not too thick you know what i mean like for example with outre shanice although i love shanice she she was very thick and i wanted her to look a certain way so i did use my revlon blow dryer brush to smooth her out but with tasty i don't feel the need to do that oh my god like look at me girl where are you going <laughs> This is insane. Y'all, this is absolutely insane. $39? Come on. Even if you buy this on Amazon, you're still gonna pay about $10 cheaper than what lace. So pick your poison, my loves. <laughs> this is beautiful either way. If you already bought Daisha, I don't see a need to run out and get tasty, but she is, she is hitting. Like, oh my god. And there is a shorter version to this unit. I forget the name. I see, I've seen a few wig bays review her. Um, I saw Ebony V review her. I'll link her video down below. And the short wig, it looks popping. I definitely want to check that one out. I think I'm going to end up copping that one. For real, for real. So yes, y'all. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Miss Tasty, are you here for her? Are you not? Are you here for Sensational Daisha or not? Let's talk in the comments. Let's have a nice discussion. Remember, check me out on buymeacoffee.com if you want to support your girl in a different way and also please let me know if you're interested in some type of membership feature if you are new to my channel you may as well subscribe because you made it this far go ahead tap that subscribe button hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos also y'all probably noticed my eyebrows are definitely going through their healing process this is currently day five by the time this video comes out it'll probably be like day eight or nine <laughs> but they are starting to scab up so that's what's going on i feel like i'm gonna have like a good week where i cannot record and i'm not even prepared for that so i'm gonna have to just figure some shit out and if you haven't seen my review on sensational daisha check it out right over here as well as my latest video over here thank y'all so so much for rocking with me as always and i'll see you in the next video bye